thing. I can look in the mirror and see that it's on. All right, test run. It's a little bit different mic setup. Lid is up. Face shield up, rather, not the lid. And we're going to go at speed with it for a minute. This is uh, approximately 40 miles an hour. Pretty damn windy. Now we're going to close the face shield. Let's see if that helps out matters any. Uh, same speed. Just going to do a quick run around the neighborhood. Check out the cam view and the audio quality. Unfortunately for me, I am not the greatest vlogger in the world. I don't talk about much stuff interesting and my shit sucks ass compared to Navy Thomas Aid and Keith SCRC 401 and Jim Payne and Andy Bumatai and 99% of all the other vloggers out there because I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Other than I'm out here riding around for the fun of it. I would like to get a... I'm not real crazy about this cam view. It's not where I wanted. I really wanted a chin mount. When I got the GoPro, that's what I was planning on doing. Until I found out that my helmets were too curved for the, 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 the sticky mount to mount on the helmet where I want it, where I need it to mount. Um, so keep that in mind for you people who want to buy a GoPro and mount it on your chin. You better make sure your helmet's got a good flat spot or at least a curved spot in the same curvature as the mounts. I thought about putting some heat to the mountain bending a little bit more but then the, if you do that then the, the GoPro's not going to click in there right so that's out so my next helmet purchase I'm looking whatever my next helmet purchase is I'm just not going to be anytime soon the next one I'm going to have is going to be uh, have a spot where I can mount my camera on my chin that way it's not sticking out the side or sticking on the top. Although, you know, I love the view that you get from the top. I really do. And, um, but I, I don't like the look of me with that view, if that makes any sense. Because it does. It's funny, I'm just cruising around the neighborhood, spot that I, uh oh if you got a shot of that. That's a cool looking house. Different. Um, so I don't normally ride in this part of the neighborhood, so uh, this is not something you normally see. So that's good. Anyway, one of these days I'll get done with tests and actually do a real vlog. God knows when that's going to be. So we'll just see. Anyway, uh, I'm going to make a point for this test to not be an hour long, like all my other tests seem to be here lately. So I'm just cruising back around to the house. We'll be back here in just a second. Try syncing up the audio with the video. And uh, go from there. Um, hell, while I'm doing this test, I want to do a shout out to a suburban rider, Chuck, uh, Bug Splat TV, Mick, and Smyrna Cowboy, Dave. Uh, I had a great time with those guys. We went for a ride on Wednesday, as I, I've already posted a video of part of that ride. 
had a great time. Those guys are a blast to hang out with. It was really fun. And uh, we've kind of semi made plans to do it again in a couple of years. So, Lord willing, if I'm still hanging around in a couple of years, I'll get to hang with them again. And that'll be a cool thing. So, test ride just about over. Back this thing up. Right to there. Shut her down. All right. So there we go. Test ride over and out.